Good morning. Would you like to try a cookie butter cold brew today? Uh, no, thank you. I have a mobile pickup for Sabrina. You need to go. Oh my God. Uh, Serena, see you at the window. Oh. He did, and he dented it. He dented the the not the the where the um the little pole that little metal thing is all dented. All right, today's the day that the Lord has made, and I will rejoice and be glad in it. Amen, amen. Today's the day, day, grand day, and I'm coming back with another video. Hey, hey, welcome everybody back. Hey, how y'all doing? How y'all been? No, it's been a minute since y'all seen my face because I've been just doing little voiceovers or whatever, whatever, whatever. But today we are Christmas shopping. Woo, woo, woo. Pow, 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 pow. I'm trying to pump myself up for it. You know, I'm just being real with you because it's like, oh, I'm God. I know. I love Christmas. I just love spending time with my family. Give me a reason to hang out with the crew. You know what I'm saying? But the gift given this year, I have been a little Scrooge. I, I think every year sometimes I have my moment where I just feel like not quite Grinch. In between Grinch and, and Mr. Scrooge, I have a little bit of those vibes. Mainly because I am not feeling as festive as I want to feel right now. Um, Because I just got so many things to do. But I am putting myself in that holiday chair right now because I gotta go get my crew... A little some little knickknacks this year i'm not going overboard like i have done years before one because they really don't need it 599 we ain't got the room this is not our permanent spot this is a very temporary 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 on temporary on temporary stuff so i'm not trying to pack anymore no like they still have stuff from christmas last year that they have not even got to play with because they ain't got no room for them to play with i gotta tell y'all what happened so which was not that big deal but it's, it's a big deal for me so um i'm sitting here minding my own little business trying to get me some duckings Voila, ooh, 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 whatever right and then you know i did my little order or whatever and then all of a sudden this car comes in the duncan little drive through because who's getting out the side of the car right now it's she's not and so i'm all like oh i need to get some gas Get gas, get gas, get gas. Anyway, so um, so this car comes in the little drive-through the uh, the wrong way, basically. So the car is looking at me like this, and I'm like, oh my, oh my God, is you, oh my God, is you are in the wrong way, Blunkin. What you doing? So he looked like he had to be a twelve. I don't know who gave him the license, who gave him the keys, who gave them license and the keys. Somebody need to be that baby. He looked like a straight up baby in the car. Anyway, go in the car, and then he's trying to turn around because he didn't went the wrong way, tearing up stuff. He ended up backing into the wall. And this is a very new Duncan's. He didn't back into the wall, made a dent into the wall. Oh, this is a lot. Uh-uh. I got enough I got enough gas. It's gonna last. I'll get gas tomorrow. Yes, I am. Mm-mm. Jesus, take the will. Oh, bless this gas for tomorrow because there's no way. There's no way. Mm-mm. Not doing it. Uh, so I was like, oh, my, oh my goodness. So yeah, that's what happened. Guy was going completely the opposite way, end up tearing some stuff up. And then, which he ended up, I don't think he realized that he did it because he turned right back in the driveway the right way. And so now I left because I had got my order. I was a little nosy because I'm like, this is the most excitement I've been having. I'm sorry, I've been stuck in the house, house and stuff. Either going, either going to doctor's appointments or going to doctor's appointments. That's pretty much it. That's all I do. And because uh, me and the crew haven't been able to really go out as much being that you know baby woo is still on oxygen and we're not taking her out uh-uh she is staying bottled up closed up and the, and the doctor told me to do that too until she's see us 2025 okay <laughs> april 2025 see us you know i'm saying about spring springtime she's gonna be blossomed then she'd be ready to mingle but right now uh-uh we keep a home girl locked up closed up so therefore we don't really go through many places and you know just for safety safety reasons
okay it was packed and that uh raw so i was trying to come in and come out real fast i'm gonna show you what i got so far the socks these are for uh what's it gabby and aubrey I didn't see anything for Brie. I got these water bottles that I'm gonna custom with the Cricut and make it all you know personalized. Cause I always like to do something personalized for them. Then I got them like underwear, socks. And then I got these cute little books um, for Sydney. I want to do something special with her when it comes to books that I never got to do with my others. I used to take them to the library all the time, but I haven't been able to. But for Sydney, I really want to get her into reading. Y'all, look at, I'm at the 99 cent only, if you do not know. <gasps> it's been a minute, but look at the decorations. Y'all, I am feeling some type of way. Oh, I want to decorate so bad, but it's like, Sabrina, stay focused, stay focused, stay focused. Eh, 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 eh. Y'all know I get distracted way too easily. Look how cute this is for Sydney. And it's only $7.99. So you already know I'm going to pick it up. Y'all. I lost my mind at $0.99 cent only. And I'm so smart. I did cash only. I did not even use my debit card. Because if I did, woo, I was going to spend way more. I only ended up spending about $80.00 for bags of stuff i bought these little wannabe crocs that were only five dollars and i mean of course my kids are not going to go to school with these but these are nice little shoes to be around the house little house shoes kind of hang out guys go the kids go in the backyard because a lot of times the kids like to hang out in the backyard they just want to grab some shoes they don't feel like putting two in shoes or whatever on they just want to slide go get the mail take out the trash them kind of you know what i'm talking about just quick little goals five dollars so you know everybody and their mama picked up a pair of those then they had barbies look at barbies look at her little shoes too she got jellies on like can you see that the jellies i'm done so they had you know mm -mm, they had all races and i wanted because i'm really big on buying all the races they even had an asian barbie and i wanted to get only reason i didn't get her because she didn't have no clothes on she was a bathing suit i was like mm -mm. Homegirl needs some clothes on, but she was a swimsuit Barbie or whatever. But my point is, a uh, girl, your girl got him, okay? And she got it. And um, they had little outfits. Here's another crock here, and they had little outfits. And these Barbies were like only five dollars a piece. The clothes were like two dollars a piece. Um, I also got some stuff for New Year's because you know we like the party uh, in my house. My kids, me, we would. Look, we may not go nowhere, but baby, we have fun in our house. I'll tell you that much. Um, so got a little New Year's hats because we're gonna be living it up. Um, they have these socks. We're not friends, friends, like friends, fans, friends, fans, friends, fans, fans, fans friends, whatever you know what I'm trying to say. We're not all of, into that, but these socks were five dollars. I said we're into it today. Um, these are definitely gonna be Jonah's, and they were kind of actually kind of cute. I thought they were kind of cute. Jonah is into like the character type socks. And it is hard shopping for him now that he's older. So with him, I'm just going to buy some something on, on like Amazon. Because he wants a new headset when he plays his video games. So I'm probably going to end up getting him something like that. But hey, I know you're like, you talking about it? It's like, first of all, my kids don't really be watching my channel like that. So I feel very comfortable because they felt. Did you my daughter side side? Did you my daughter told me that I was boring? I said, what's that? Oh my goodness! You know what? They're at that age where I guess I'm not cool anymore. But whatever. Anyway, so rent over. Um, look how cute these are, right? So they had a whole bunch of little two dollars for the outfits. So I spent like thirteen dollars. So my daughter got two dolls and three little outfits. Perfect. Okay, and then. They had little pens because my kids uh, like to draw and stuff. I'm going to find some cute notebooks. Then they had little stocking suckers like that. I'm trying not to take everything out, but I definitely want to give you the highlights of what I got. A weekly planner because you guys know I'm a planner, babe. I love all kind of planners. I'm planner, planner, planner. But look how cute. These are erasers, but they say BFF. Uh, 
bracelets but they're erasers though how cute is that right i thought that was kind of cute so i got them little stuff like that and that was only that was only a dollar i bought two poster boards that is for the parties that are coming up the pipeline did i show you another little croc shoe look bam like oh and did i show you i got me another little calendar only was that was only four dollars for that um so yeah and that's just look i just gave you a taste of the stuff that i got i got quite a few th things oh in here too i'm sure you can that Ugh. a little garland that's for party stuff pencils for the kids um look how cute these little racers i thought they'd be cute little stocking stuffers because my kids are into little stuff like that i need to go to dasso but i ran out of cash so we're gonna have to budget that later because they have more little things uh that the crew would definitely be into that I just uh do little stocking stuffers with but yeah i got all of that i am super i'm happy about the stuff that i got i just still need to get little stuff for jonah um, I didn't find any, like, chapstick stuff that I was trying to look for, um, at this 99 cent only, because they normally do. Um, it's getting close to the time for me to actually pick up the crew. What time is it? Let me see what time. What time is it? Because I'm, yeah, I don't know if I have enough time to hit up one more store. I might have time if I can hit up one more store to see what I can find. The thing is, I can probably get what I need to get and get out, um, because I really want to go to a Dollar Tree. Ooh, that's pushing it. I might can go in and get get in, get out. Maybe. Possibly. Possibly. Because I really just want to get like some chapstick. And I still have, I am still have a couple more dollars left in my budget to get what I want to get. So I'm in Target trying to figure out what to get the crew. I did find these shoes for Brie. Brie always said that she wants some heels. So I'm like, okay. Um, she usually just gets my hand-me-downs, but her feet are actually bigger than mine now. Girl, why am I girl 5'5"? Five five? It just lets you know I'm a 5'3 on a good day. You know what I'm saying? What I'm hoping, like in my in my dreams. So, I have a whole baby that's 5'5". Five five. Anyway, what was I going to say? So, I found that, and then I found these little trinkets, little things, stuff. And I still didn't find none for Jonah. So I'm definitely, most definitely gonna have to find something, very much something online. Cause I don't know, I don't know. Of course, when you are in a time crunch, everything wants to be crazy. So on my way checking out the, at Target, the machine, the checkout machines wants to jam. I'm like, oh my gosh. And not just that, I was gonna use my Target red card to cause um because you know I was limited on cash. Um, just to get a couple more things, and plus you get extra five percent off when you use the target, you know, the target red card, whatever. So I was like, cool, I can use that because I the things only came up to like 24 bucks, a couple of the extra little things that I got there. I was like, okay, good. And so I looked in my wallet, luckily, that's exactly I had just about that plus with my cash rewards i had to pay in cash because oh I'm all this. <sighs> of course when you are in a time crunch everything wants to go high wire and so i'm like running late right now to pick up my kids they're probably gonna be outside waiting for me but anyway so i'm in the checkout the machine no i'm in the checkout I decided to use my Target red card because you get the extra 5% off and I had some cash rewards because you know I shop at Target a lot so anyway so I had like three dollars left or whatever but so because the whole total came up to like $24 and I was like still because I got you know all those little knickknack things from the dollar bin or dollar section or whatever um so I was cool I was happy but the thing is my Target red card wasn't in my purse boo so i want to use my phone but then for some reason wanted me to verify my card uh, didn't have my card so luckily i had maybe like just enough cash on me like i'm talking about to the t like 20 dollars, right so i'm stuffing in the machine stuffing in the machine guess what happens she machine gets jammed i'm like crap right and now i'm like i'm already late 
but now I'm late to her because I had to tell the lady, hey, this machine jam. Then she couldn't get this machine to work, and I'm like, oh, brother. So, like, Leo's just like, then she had to go help other people. I'm like, girl, I gotta go pick up my kids, right? So, finally, we get to another machine. She just hands me a stack of ones and says, uh, she, no, finally, we get to another machine. And so, um, then she just hands me like a stack of ones. She's like, start here and just start stuffing in the machine. I said, okay, whatever. Um, Lisa say, she ended up actually, I ended up at, I even have to be, it ended up being even less because as I was putting the money in the machine, the machine wasn't, you know, taking my money or whatever. Um, and I, I think I had like $4 left to put in there when, before I got jammed, but the lady ended up giving me the extra $4. She just gave me, she just kept giving me money from the, another register to put in that machine so I can pay to leave. Needless to say, it ended up being like 17 bucks for me instead of being whatever it was supposed to be. So that was plus. But the downside is, uh, I'm about to be late, late and I'm in traffic. So uh, whatever though i'm pretty much done with christmas shopping hey only thing i need to do is go to dollar tree i do want to go to dollar tree and see i don't want to go to dollar tree i might not even need to go to dollar tree to be honest no i am because i want to get them some like little chapstick still want to get chapstick they did have like like the little lip you know you know y'all know what i'm talking about the little girly stuff they did have that at target but i'm not spending it was expensive i'm not spending ten dollars that my children are literally just gonna rub on their lips a hundred million times and it's gonna be gone in a day. No, I buy them the dollar stuff because my, my girls don't know how to act, okay? If they knew how to act, I would love to buy them the Victoria's Secret lip gloss. I would love to get them in. I would love, are you kidding me? I love it. But mama, mama ain't got money like that for y'all to take lipstick and just on your lips and y'all look like y'all didn't have like 18 pieces of chicken and then y'all talk about, oh, we ain't got no more chapsticks. Ma'am, because it's all on your lips. That's why. Your lips, nobody's lips that crusty, okay? So, mama's lips cr crusty like that right now, but that's not the point. My point is, say, uh, I'm not spending that much money on those. Not yet. Not yet. When they get a little bit more mature and know how to handle things a little bit better, we can then come back to that discussion, okay? But who? I am a very feeling very f successful on my Christmas shopping. Um, especially with me being on a budget. Um, I did not get anything for Sydney. Even though this is our first Christmas. Okay, this ain't my first rodeo when it comes to kids. This ain't my first rodeo having kids, a baby, on Christmas. Because you gotta think, Brielle's birthday is December 18th. So, when December 20th, I had a baby, baby, belly could hold her head up. And I went all stupid and crazy and bought her a whole bunch of stuff. Did she even know what Christmas was? I know. The girl ain't gonna know what Christmas is until she's about three. Let's just be real. Because I remember buying a whole bunch of stuff for Aubrey when she turned two. And she was looking at it like, what is this stuff? What are y'all talking about? I want to go back to bed. Okay? I am tired. So she wasn't even feeling it, for real. So it took her a minute. You know, it took them about three. Like, once they get to about three, that's when you can go ham, burger, grits, eggs, and cheese. Ooh. Thank you guys so much for all your love and support that you guys show this channel. I really do. And you guys, when I, I appreciate y'all. When I say, was it, spam the comment section with hearts. Y'all said hearts. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate the love. Because it really, y'all, y'all really make me I mean, Some of y'all have YouTube channels. Some of y'all don't. But really, to be honest with you, comments is where it's at when it comes to uh, commenting, sharing, subscribing. All of those things help my video out more. Watching the full video to the end, all of that stuff. Hey, maybe even watching an ad or two if it's like 10 or 27. I'm just like, clicking on a link when I have a, you know, have a. Um, have sponsorship just actually clicking on just clicking on the link helps me out and purchasing of course if there's something that you guys really are interested in all that stuff really does help. It, it's just click really does like it really does um so and i appreciate that you guys um do that for my channel so definitely if you feel like it you know you're like i'm just gonna help my girl out i'm just gonna Spam her comment section with a whole bunch of heart. You know, don't get yourself in trouble. We don't need you to get, you know, locked up. You know what I'm saying? But if you want to put a little comment or two or three or four of some hearts, I appreciate it. 
Um, uh, I'm gonna end this vlog because I'm about to hop into mama mode and you already know how that is. Um, you know, I gotta get homework, boo, 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 boo. Even though they're about to get out of school for winter break, I'm so here for it. Woo. I need that. But I'm so here for it. Um, I gotta get into that. Anyway, I'll catch you guys on my next video. If you guys are not subscribed, make sure you go ahead and do that. Um, and as always, guys, I love you. God bless. Mwah. Love you. Bye.